The gang's all here. Hi honeys, it's your queen me. I'm gonna be doing a makeup tutorial on how to do this cute little gingerbread uh, makeup look. Um, I will throw up a picture somewhere in this video of what my inspiration came from. And, um, cause I don't remember off the top of my head what his name is. But yeah, I seen that and I was like, ooh, okay. So I wanna do that. So I got this shirt from Romwe, not sponsored. I just love their stuff so much. And that's basically it. So I'll go ahead and um, just keep watching this video to find out how I did this. And hopefully you guys like this video. And um, it was helpful and like actually a tutorial. And comment down below if it actually helped you. And with all that being said, stay tuned. So before I get into the tutorial, I'm going to show you what I've already done. And then um, with the order I've done it in, that way we can get into the fun stuff and this not be a long and boring video. So what I first did was I applied this Mascology Face Serum and then I also did this Hard Candy Redness Relief Serum and then what I did was put on my concealer from Essence which is in the shade uh, 20 which is light ivory, it is the matte one. And um, before I did my foundation I took this I Do Care Straight Radiant Highlighter and I just put it right here, right here and then over here patted it in with my sponge, then took my powder foundation from Maybelline, it is the Dream Wonder Powder in the shade 60, which is sandy beige. Then I refreshed my freckles with this Lemon Crying Sun Kissed Freckle Pin, and then did a little bit of contour with this NYX um, Sculpt and Highlight Face Duo in the shade Ivory. I only really did this part and I just did it where I normally do my contour. Then I set it all with this Essence Brighten Up Banana Powder. And then I moved on to my eyebrows, which are super easy. All I do is use this Essence Brow Pen in the shade Brown. And then I put the number three, which is the CoverGirl Easy Breezy Brow. And I use that highlighter underneath. And then I take and set my eyebrows with this Color Workshop Brow Wax. And we are all caught up. So obviously I'm doing um, these things. I almost called them candy canes, uh, gingerbread man. So we're gonna be doing a little gingerbread man everywhere, but first we have to put on the eyeshadow. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply my base and then jump right into it. We are only gonna be using one palette for this look and then um, like a couple other little things, but we're only using one main palette for this whole look. It is the Too Faced Gingerbread Spice eyeshadow palette. And I'm just gonna real quick show you these um, that way you guys can get a good look at them because I don't think I'm going to be like showing you guys um, every single time I'll just be saying what the name is because this one is labeled and that makes it a little bit easier on me and I mean Yeah, so I went ahead and applied my eyeshadow base, which is this essence I heart stage Eyeshadow base. So now we're going to jump right into using the Too Faced palette for the eyeshadow so the first color we're going to take is this gingerbread latte, which is one of the lighter browns in the palette. And we're just going to go like everywhere. <laughs> But we're just going to do that like kind of over here a little bit, over to the side. <music> then we're going to take the orange color, which is Spice and Nice, and just go kind of on the middle. <music> shimmery color that's in there which is the spiked eggnog and just go just a little bit in the middle of where we put the orange and then we're going to do the same thing that we did from the top onto the bottom so I'm going to do that real quick and come back with the next step so we are going to be using this Milani eyeshadow primer and we're going to be doing it right in the middle, just a little tiny bit, because we are going to be putting on this ColourPop Glitterly Obsessed. Um, it is called In Vogue. It's like the orange um, glitter gel. And we're just going to be patting that on, but we want to make sure it stays, so we're going to be doing this. <laughs> And 
Next step is um, we want to put like white right here because it is a gingerbread and they have the white icing. So I'm using the Physician's Formula Butter Highlighter and I'm just going to take my finger and just kind of do a little highlight in the corners of my eye. And then we want to do the eyeliner and the mascara. So while I do that real quick because it's like the normal thing I always do, just a simple winged eyeliner and then my mascara, I'll of course show you and tell you um, when I'm done what I used. but. I will cut to the um, explanation. Okay, so I went ahead and got some of the other stuff done. Um, what I did was in the following order. The eyeliner I used was this Too Faced Better Than Sex um, like eyeliner pin thing. And then for my mascara, I used both of these. One is the Essence Keep Big Lashes. I did this on both top and bottom. And then I use the Rebel London Scandal Eyes Volume Mascara. And I use that on top and bottom as well. And then I did my waterline with this white pen from Maybelline New York. It is the Lasting Drama and it is in the color white. And then I went ahead and touched up the um, orange glitter stuff on the top. And then I did um, a little touch up on the highlighter. And I also used this highlighter from Smoke and Mirrors. And again, just in the middle in the corner of my eye. And then I went ahead and did a little bit of my contour with the Revolution Roxy palette. And I just did, you know, my normal contour. And then I used a little bit of this Physicians Formula to highlight a little bit up here and here. And then, I mean, that's it. So we are caught up and we are ready to move on to the fun stuff. What we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be doing um, this little part right here first. And we're gonna be taking this um, more red shade right here of the contour palette and just doing all that. Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer from the um, Maru Maru um, brand, palette, whatever line of stuff. <laughs> so then we're going to take this Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer and we're just going to do a little bit of where we went over. <laughs> the Physicians Formula Butter Blush and just do um, just right here really. So now we're going to do um, just a little bit of highlight up here and um, just on my nose just like right here really like on the bridge and we're taking the Smoke and Mirrors um, Golden Sugar Palette and we're doing this top one up here which is Summer which is the um, darkest one. And then I'm gonna touch up the white highlighter right here with the same Physicians Formula Butter Highlighter that we've been using. So I'm actually going to take this um, Maybelline eyeliner like we did for the waterline and I'm going to draw um, some of the gingerbread that way because I feel like it would take too much time with this but I will go over it with this if I feel it is necessary so we're just going to do a couple gingerbread man a couple hearts fill in some of them with um, this eyeliner pen and again go over it with this white one so I'm gonna go ahead and do the details and then you guys can see from there what I've done <laughs> So I'm going to try to do a couple different things. This one, I just tried doing um, freehanded. This one, I'm going to try to outline with the white. Well, fill it in first and then outline it. 
I'm gonna see which one looks better and then go from there as to how I do the rest of the designs. <laughs> Okay, so that one was kind of easy. It was quick. So I'm, uh, I don't know, I'm feeling like I can probably do all of them that way, but we're gonna try doing this and seeing if those guidelines are any better. <laughs> actually doing the brown first and then doing the white would actually be a little bit easier and less time consuming. So I'm going to do a couple little ones over here. doesn't make much sense like looking at it but I'm gonna go ahead and do a couple more <laughs> Okay, so this is um, all the decoration done. Um, the products I used were these things from Wish. It are these um, two eyeliners that are colored, and I don't know what they're called. I think they're called Hendian or Hendian. If you guys can see that, and then this one that just says glitter. It is a glitter eyeliner, and um, this last thing I used was just to see if it would even like look cool or like do anything. It really didn't do anything. It was the Maybelline um, light liner, and that is pretty much it. So I'm going to do the lips, and then we'll be done. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the lips off camera, and then I will be back with my hair down and the whole look complete. So, 
stay tuned. Okay, so I went ahead and did my lipstick and I did my hair. So what I did for my lipstick was I used this lip liner from um, Buxom and then I used these two um, Revolution cushion lip tints and I used the one in 200 and 210 and then I used this lip, lip gloss from Buxom and it is in Masculine Masco <laughs> Masco Mule. So then I just brushed my hair, parted it how I normally do, or have been doing anyways, and that's basically it. So as you can see, I am part of my little gingerbread family right here. I just want to tell you guys that some of the videos after this one, it is Friday, this is going up, um, same day. Uh, they're going to be a little bit more um, scheduled because Christmas is coming up and I got stuff planned up until New Year's. So I have a couple of videos, uh, a lot of videos I'm going to be doing one day for New Year's um, that whole week or something. I don't, I'm still trying to figure it out. But yeah, so don't be freaked out if it's scheduled. It's only going to be scheduled till like after the New Year. It'll be fine because the second I will come back and I will be um, just every single day except for um, the weekends obviously and I actually have my work schedule for um, my army stuff and I am going to be working on some of the weekdays so some of my videos will be scheduled but for now don't worry about it it's fine I'm still here and I think that's really all um, I didn't want to make a, a I didn't want to make an update video because it was just so minuscule and I mean the new year I can like update you guys on that so that's why I was holding off but just to give you a little snippet of it right now that's why I told you so hopefully you guys found this video fun educational entertaining and enjoyable and um make sure to give this video a like make sure to subscribe check out all my social medias in the description below comment down below if you would ever try this look and what your thoughts and opinions are on it and I think with all that being said um Thanks for stopping by. Love you.